Hi there, it's Nurgle. Welcome back to Cardo, where we play a young cartographer searching mysterious lands looking for her grandmother. And how do we do that? Puzzle solving and lateral thinking, of course. Let's get going. So last time, we were in a sort of ancient tree maze, and then we ended up in a brand new land. And as is the case with this, we need to put all this together. We need to make this into something that makes sense. So let's try and do that, shall we? All right, so let's see here. Take this, let's just, let's just kind of blur all these around. See what we're looking at. I mean, I think that looks basically right. So what if we do that? Okay, move, up, move over here there, buddy. And then we take this one and do like that. Then we give them a little Let's see. Uh, I think that I'm trying to figure out how to, that one doesn't work there. That's interesting. Because that one's wrong, maybe. Maybe this one goes up here. Hmm. Curiouser and curiouser. Okay, so I think. Hold on, let's just let's move this one out of the way because I think that may be potentially problematic. That goes there. You know, I'm, I'm curious. I wonder if these, I mean, these aren't really interchangeable at all. Uh, no, they are. So let's see. Let me take this one. Put that there. That looks pretty good, I think. We take the other one, this one, put this here. Not that all fits together, good. And then let's see. I feel like maybe this one's upside down. Oh, it is, okay. Okay, that makes, that, that makes a big difference. Uh, hold on. Oh yeah, okay, that, that goes there, yeah. And then this one goes here. Okay, oh, that's okay, that fits together. There we go. Hey, look, somebody appeared. Let's go talk to him. Uh, which way were they from us? South. Okay, this way. Who is it? Why is this glowing? A broken stone bearing part of an incomplete symbol. Okay. Oh, this way. Oh, there we go. Excuse me, sir. Russell, Russell, Russell. Russell, Russell, Russell. Russell, Russell, Russell. What? Lily, woo, woo, baba, loo. Ah, much better. I almost forgotten how to speak the common language all, all these years. Wise as she is, mother isn't much for conversation. But it's good to see you here, messenger. The first to arrive. Bravo! As you know, I am the Watcher. You must receive the signal. Which forest do you journey from? And where's your animal companion? Are they, a, are they an insect of some sort? Hello, my tiny friend. You can come out now. Uh... Upon closer inspection, perhaps you are not a messenger. Then how do you traverse these woods, wild as they are? <laughs> I see. Still, you found your way through the underground maze and overcame the tricks of the wild one. Navigation is in your blood, dear girl. You remind me of someone, you know, in my youth across the sea. There was a young woman. Huh? Ah, never mind. Simply a passing impossibility. 
Have you caught a glimpse of the messengers yet? I wonder which one mother would choose. Huh. Ah, yes. I suppose this ritual would be a mystery to you. Messengers, watchers, saplings, animal companions. It's all very ancient and fascinating. Let's say we take a walk and I can give you an entire oral history. Humor, old man. I haven't spoke to anyone in decades. Huh. When the mother tree has reached the end of a thousand year growth, the current watcher must put her to sleep using flames of the wildwood. Her life essence carpets the entire forest, spurring a millennium of new growth. Oh. Ah, hello there. Messenger Nyap of Barons and Vulture. Travel to far. We bring sapling. I will be watch her. Yes, hello, welcome. I'm just in the middle of a yard. Please go and wait by mother and I'll be with you shortly. The smoke from mother also acts as a signal to the forest tribes, which each sends a message, messenger, bearing a sapling from their village. Once the messenger reach mother and plant their saplings, they must recite the 87 stanzas of the rhyme of Wildwood. Oh, God. Hey. Ah, more messengers. Tidings, Watcher. And to you too, small one. It is, it is no surprise to see you here. Recat from the Redwood Forest. My foxy friend and I are ready for the ritual. Cholmac of the Evergreen. And my bear. Truly it's an honor to be in Mother's Embrace. I feel cozy already. Welcome, messenger and woodland companions. Please gather up, Mother. I'm almost done regaling our friend here with our traditions. After the saplings are planted, Mother will choose one of them to embody her regrowth. The messenger who provided the saplings will become the new watcher, and their tribe will protect Mother throughout her growth. As each watcher grows old, another from the tribe will take over, and, and that elder watcher may go home and live out their days in the village. As you may have guessed, I'm the final, final watcher of my line, and I'm ready to turn to my village. Hmm. I wonder if they'll make those toasted bananas back home. Our final messenger. You're just in time for toasted bananas. I mean, the ritual. <laughs> oh. Curb is exhausted, but Curb has sapling. Definitely original sapling. <clears throat> Curb here. Of the coniferous. Curb will surely never be chosen as watcher, but excited to attend. I'll call your stay in the Wildwood. Hello, beardless one. Hello. Everyone is here. It's time to wake Mother. Let us gather. Mother, it is time to awaken. Your children have traveled from the farthest forest. Redwood, Barrens, Evergreen, Coniferous. And I, your watcher, ready for my rest. We gather here to begin your rebirth. Messengers, produce your saplings, the strongest, most beautiful specimen of your forest. Huh. Let us plant them and stir mother from her slumber. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep, bear guy is going to plant his. Yep. And the guy who's trying to cheat. Okay, let's see what happens. Yep. <laughs> yep, the ghost lily. Wonder what's gonna happen. Hey, it's a ghost lily. Hmm. A ghostly glow. What a strange new sapling. Now this trace is clear. Messengers, the next watcher is Cherub of the Coniferous. Huh? Hey? Oh? What? <laughs> okay, this seems not great, but <laughs> yep. Um, Cherub is so confused. Why well, is he the watcher? Cherub isn't good at watching anything. Must have been the sapling you gave Cherub. Special sapling. Cherub isn't special. Cherub wants to go home. Huh. Well, it seems confusing. Yep. Odd choice, Trib, but respect it. Huh. Mother grow taller than the sky. Want to witness. Huh. Patience. Patience. 
Hi, Foxy. <laughs> ah, well. It would have been nice to be chosen, but Mother does what's best for the entire forest. We'll stick around for a bit in case Jared needs help. I'll be seeing you, small one. I'll be seeing you, small one. Hold on. Oh, yep, I see. Hi, bear. Oh. <laughs> oh. We we're believed we weren't chosen, honestly. We love exploring, but we're not as happy staying in one place. Mother must have known that. She's so wise. Rest for a while, and then who knows? Rest for a while, and then who knows? Okay, well, let's talk to this guy then. Good, good. The ritual was a success. Mother chose Cherub's sapling, and thus he becomes the new watcher. He may not feel ready, but Mother knows best. The mere act of being chosen will start him down the path. Mother is in no rush. I'm glad you could join us for the ritual. Perhaps you'd like to say goodbye to the other messengers. Then I can show you the path out. Okay, uh, I think I did already. Yeah, okay, so I already did. So, let's talk. Sounds like the other messengers will be sticking around a bit longer. I'll soon be making my own journey home once I've shown true of the ropes. May I show you the path out of Wildwood? Yes. Take your time. Oh, wait, hold on. <laughs> May I show you the path out of Wildwood? Uh, nod, not shake head. Nod. Shake means no, nod means yes. Great, follow me. Jerub, please join us. It's time for your first lesson. Okay. The watcher must learn the language of the trees. Watch carefully, Cherub. Russell, Russell, Russell. The forest favors you this day. Please, take this token. Oh, thanks. It was destiny that you should come here, and with this, you'll never use your way into Wildwood. I'm glad you could join us, and thank you for helping Cherub replace his lost sapling. What? You can't fool the Watcher, Cherub. You'll understand one day. Mother sees all, and she shall choose you. Worry not. Go, little one. I'm sure we'll see you soon. And give my best to your grandmother. What? Wow. Travel safe, and pray for Cherub. Okay. I guess we go in here. Ooh. Where are we? We're in a brand new part of the forest. We'll have to explore this and see what's up. But that is going to be next time. Thanks for watching this playthrough of Cardo. Coming up next, we got a new forest to explore. Thanks for watching again, and I'll see you next time for more Cardo. See you then.